Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, Attorney Sharif Silmi. As you know, we have been uh, moving lots of people from the EB2 backlog and porting their cases um, using the EB1A extraordinary ability category. So individuals who are out there, particularly those that work in um, the privacy sector, um, those who work in, I would say, areas of national importance, um, have been seeing lots of great success with EB1A. I wanna give you an update because the July bulletin was uh, released and we see a huge increase in the EB1A um, India final action date, where the previous date for final action for India was June of 2016. This, that was uh, June 2020 bulletin. The July 2020 bulletin has August 1st, 2017. This is a 13 month jump toward the end of the fiscal year. That is really um, uh, something that we have not seen in past years. We can kind of you know, think that these are probably related to uh, some of the COVID related suspensions of uh, immigrant visas from outside the US. Nonetheless, individuals who are in the US adjusting status, they would definitely benefit from this. And it's gonna be really interesting to see what happens by October, because if we are seeing this much progress in the end of the fiscal year, I would anticipate that October, we're probably gonna be current. So, um, you know, going out on a limb here. So I would definitely advise individuals who um, are thinking about porting their status from the EB2 backlog to EB1, right now is the time, because we need to really have that summer time to prepare the case in order that it is submitted and adjudicated in time for the fall. So, um, you know, really positive news there on the, uh, relatively positive news on the EB1 um, front for India. And I would also, I think, you know, look positively upon the EB2 category moving one month. Again, um, you know, for this time of the year, still an enormous and unjust backlog, but for this time of the year, I think that is very positive. So. Uh, thank you. And, you know, this is uh, intended for educational purposes. Do not rely um, on this to act or fail to act. Always consult with an attorney for all of your immigration needs and um, look forward to hearing from everyone. Take care.